Howdy, welcome to Fish Tales. <laughs> oh my god, they must be. I see a severe lack of trash. Hmm, how unusual. They must be really running herd on this place now. Getting the water. Well, this is a special time of the day. Water still has not cleared up. Look at that. That steam rising off the water. Things are happening everywhere on the river. They're neat. behind me get my fly rod well, I'm gonna start with conventional gear throw conventional gear a little bit until I catch a fish then I'll switch to a fly rod water's still in the 70s high 70s feels good 
air temperature is in the 60s but it doesn't feel like it it feels warmer than that such a beautiful day now I'm gonna get serious and catch me a fish hit those little shady spots in the edge any 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 dark spot you see in the water that might be a deep spot that's where you want to hit a shady area over here on this side you see that shady area there's likely to be a large mouth in here okay I don't know how deep this pool gets. You know, I didn't didn't plan on getting completely wet, but the water feels so nice. It's unusual. I've been down here when it's a hundred freaking degrees. Yeah. <laughs> Top half was not comfortable. Bottom half was okay. I'm gonna put my drag line out from the boat, otherwise it's gonna get it's good. I'm gonna put my drag chain out. There you go. There's a little bass. Ooh, there he is. And that's a largemouth. First fish was a spotted and the second's a largemouth. Little one. Like that old beetle spin lure. Beetle spin spinner bait. Made a slight modification to it, not much. There you go. Thanks for coming. Some bad news. See how that snake's holding his head up high? I can guarantee you that is a water moxin. And he's coming to investigate us. Wow, look at that rascal. Any questions? That is a water moxin. He's a little close for comfort, but he's going in those side now. Look at that rascal, man. If you're gonna fish in Texas, you gotta be looking out for those rascals.
there's another water moccasin right there might even be the same one I don't know about the same size that wicked dude man that is bad news no matter how you look at it that's bad news and my boat wants to go toward him I'm not picking anything up. That wind, that wind picked up, and the fishing just kind of seemed to die. I'm not sure if it's just a coincidence or not. There you go. There's my Zebco 33. Well, Eddie, let me see if I can fix this thing up and send it to you. <laughs> Back in the main river channel. There's two different types of vegetation. You got that stuff and you got that stuff. See, there's a difference. It's the first time I've seen that here. What is it? What kind of snake is that? Well, we're going right at him though. <laughs> slips back in there. That was probably a diamondback water snake. Common snake around here. There you go. Slow rolling. Slow rolling was the key. Get it down there deep. Off he goes. Bet I can do that again. The key was getting it down deep. Just slow rolling along the bottom. The deer right there. Yeah, that little old deer walking right there. Was it buck or what? No, no doe. Little doe. Cool. That's what I like about being in a kayak. They do not care. There's a paleated woodpecker down there getting a drink, I think. Big rascal, redhead. He's just up inside that tree now. He was right there by that log. If I saw him, I think I might have him on video. See that right there? Paleated woodpecker. Getting a drink of water. There's two of them.
couple of them in here. There's my goal for the day. The railroad bridge. That's as far as I'm going. interesting I'm sorry you didn't see that Thanks for coming. I bet there's more of them in here. I was slow rolling that thing, throw it up in these rocks, and then just bounce it off the bottom. That technique really works. I just lost about a two pound largemouth. He jumped, missed him. I tried to avoid coming onto this side this close, because these bass will hang right at the edge of these rocks. Oh well. Started fly fishing a little bit. Started with a popper. Didn't really have any confidence in it whatsoever. So I'm going to put on that cone head crawdad looking thing. Let's see if that works. Nice one, huh? That's getting a little better. Well, it took all summer, but the river has returned. The fishing, at least. That water got a little bit clearer, and the fishing was okay wasn't as good as this time last year well, we had a heck of a trip then but i got to see a few things i hadn't seen before like that fog boy that was interesting there was little swirlies in there and of course the birds and the wildlife it's always something to see you can tell that falls beginning to hit us down here got a whole bunch of these little bass couple of good ones but more importantly had a very good day avoided getting snake bit it's the first time I've seen two water moccasins at the same time down on the river but they're just part of nature they were out looking for breakfast like everything else I gotta eat you know hey thanks for watching y'all be good bye